Hi, I'm Chris Ricotta, Director of Success with Dr. Beasley's, and this is Behind the Detail. So we have been getting a lot of questions about the self-healing capabilities of NanoResin Pro. So let's talk a little bit about the science of NanoResin Pro. As opposed to a lot of those polymer-based coatings, this is an elastomer-based coating. So what that means is it can rebound. So generally in the science of solid mechanics, you have three responses to force. That is plasticity, elasticity, and fracture. So plasticity is a dense and doesn't recover. Elasticity is a dense, but it can recover. And of course you have fracture, where something comes in contact and it shatters. So this is really where Dr. Beasley's differentiates themselves because we are not concerned with 9H hardness. That ultimate hardness does not make a difference to us because we understand that what you want in a self-healing uh, coding is that ability to be able to bounce back and that's exactly what we intend to demonstrate here So that's some pretty decent swirl marks right there. So let's go ahead and leave that there and now I'm going to take down our heat gun And we're going to crank it up full fan and we're about uh, halfway up on the heat scale And what we're going to do Is generally just work it back and forth and heat up the panel and you can see some of that micromarine fading away some of the deeper ones might take a bit longer but most of that lighter micromarine has already disappeared i think that gives us a pretty good idea here that any of this micromarine we still see a little bit of the lighter stuff but we'll have to come back again and hit some more after it cools a little bit but you know, that gives you a really nice idea of what the capability is here. So, I mean, generally what we're looking to do is, I mean, shouldn't even really have to put heat on this. You know, you just pull it out and into the sun and let the sun as a giant IR lamp kind of do its thing. Thanks again, everybody, for watching. I'm Chris Rakana, and this has been Behind the Details.